let's go been playing, got a really bad habit If it moves, gotta grab it Fuse like a magnet Lose, won't have it Till I'm doomed in a casket I ain't playing, got a weird mind If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine If the shit tastes sour, you should taste mine I'ma stay in power for a long time Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter Big picture, I'm a straight killer I send the song to the highest bidder Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back, better than last year It's a new me, never gonna look back You're never gonna look back Cause damn, I was built to last You move slow when I move fast And that's facts Only I can make a change Slowly take a step today I will never be the same Cause that's what it takes So I kind of ended that at, like a couple beats early. Hello, everybody. Oh my gosh, this is like record time. A few things to discuss today before we get into the unoriginal meat and potatoes. Uh, how are y'all doing? So many things happened today. And of course, I had to witness them after the fact. Uh, but really quick, let me say hello to y'all because I didn't do it like yesterday. Hi, Irish Lass, Health, Wealth, and Hope, JoJo, hello, Gypsy Vano, Stacey A.B., uh, William, hello, 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 um, to Cyber Hotline, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, Angie G, April NYC, Sweets and Beyond, uh, hello to Kelly, Nurse Jen, Pass. Secret Treasures, Dirty Bitch Coochie Puta, Hello Dreamy Dot, Hello. I'm going to start singing our, our roll call like they do at Mass. <laughs> Could y'all imagine? Uh, anyway, hello Annie. Uh, let me put a little banner up and preface the stream by saying, and by the way, the reason the real bother is about the whole birthday ruining shit is if this all is about money. So if you feel like it, if you have some change, or if you just want to, it's never expected. Just always appreciate it. There's a little cash up at the bottom. And as always, Super Chats, uh, memberships, and stickers are always available. Let's proceed. Finger in the fucking fish made an appearance today on Slopey's channel. It's been brought to my attention. I can't say one word about that weirdo without her having to be like, what, it was really gross. Did y'all, like, do y'all want to see that really quick? I, uh, and then also Miss Moon went live and I've only been able to catch the very beginning. I didn't get to see that one. Um, so much has happened. It's a shame we're still on this beef flip out video. I mean, my gosh, but good news. Uh, hi, Bambi. I will probably be able to go live a lot of this weekend because the boys are doing boy things. Uh oh. Why does my 
I swear I better not have a scratch on my screen. I don't. Okay. So real quick, let's take a look at the uh, famous Dallas Square Tears video. I mean, I'm sorry, cameo on Sophie's video. Simply Sophie. Let's see, where is it at? Billy Badass is in the building. Hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. Still, Ben, I came into John's chat the other night. I bet he was wrapping it up. Yeah. Um, I wasn't sure but, if that was you. Oh, yeah, that was me. Yeah. Um, but for some odd reason, I got this uh, email this morning that the nurse got all wet and gooey down below because uh, Bombshell posted my comment. Oh, dear baby Jesus. Already talking. You're not up there for 30 seconds. And she already got to talk about a wet and gooey something or other. Man, don't you ever. Keep your nasty over there, nasty. I didn't want to, ew. Met, I guess on her community tab. And she's like, oh, ever back around. Oh, bitch, I've never been gone, ho. I've never been gone. That's rich that you're calling me a ho. Ho. You won't even, you're, you are such a, you're not even a good prostitute. You won't even let the lights come on. You've got a light restriction. For your johns, what kind of shit is that? Yeah, you've been here orgasming every time you see my name. But don't worry, I'm not coming back onto YouTube because I have better shit to do than stream your bullshit. But as long as it made you happy just to see my little name, I hope it was a big gushing, squirting one, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> and her. So I have Okay, and now we're thank you so much, Help Wealth and Hope, for the super chat. Um, and now you're saying now you're gonna mention squirting, you just had to mention squirting, huh? You just had to do that, huh? Finger in the fishy. Since you gave me that super chat, Help Wealth and Hope, let's remind everybody about finger in the fish. If you're blue and you don't know where to go to, why don't you go where fashion sits? Putting on the ritz. Different types who wear a day coat, pants with stripes and cut away coat, perfect fits. Putting on the ritz. Dressed up like a million dollar trooper. And trying hard to look like Gary Cooper. Come, let's mix where Rockefellers walk with sticks or umbrellas in the midst. Putting on the ring. For the super chat, you nasty, you nasty. You send men your nudes and they still don't want you. She's like, no, you can go back to. She can go back to JJJ. She can go to Savage Live. Um, she can go to all the shit. You know the the, the drama community. I've never been gone. You dumb blonde bitch. I've never been gone. I'm blonde, bitch. Remember that time you were trying to get my hair color and length? Thank you, April, for the super chat. Making it rain with the umbrellas. Haha, <laughs> Amber, you're so stupid. Fine. This whole entire time I've been in chat. It's just Bombshell hasn't noticed me because. Lily, Lita, listen, it's your ex bestie. It's your bestie, Miss Miss. Finger in the fit ish. What about her? Right. She's a fat, irrelevant bitch. And so are you, Brooke. There you go. I'm so yeah. irrelevant that you've woken from the dead to come hop on a panel and talk about little old me. 
I love the Reddit thing. With, have y'all seen the midget thing? I'm oh, sorry, small person thing um, with her head on it. No. That shit was funny. That shit was funny. I laughed at that. Bravo to whoever did that. Oh, my God. You have to play it. I think it's in 90 days. But, I mean, I'm, I, I, I'm not um, that short. I mean, I am, sh- I, am, I am a petite woman, but I'm not. Uh, that was kind of slanderish, but yeah, it is what it is. It was funny. It's fucking hysterical. Hey, Amber. <laughs> hey, Joel. It is I saw freaking it hilarious. On Reddit. It's really funny, Sophie. I uh, figured I'm putting wow. on makeup. I might as well just be here uh, on here while I'm putting makeup on. <laughs> I got it. I don't have to look at the chat. Yeah. <laughs> Ten days. But yeah, it is, it's hilarious. But no, I mean, I, I don't know why she got all wet and gushy because she saw my name but it's not a stock account obviously it's all this woman thinks about is sex that's all you think about amber everything's got to have a sexual connotation to it it's gross okay okay it's gross you're gross we don't want to be you you be lita were you around when we found out uh amber was a whole ass escort up in dallas and she and she marketed herself as the squirting queen of dallas did you know that lita your ex ex bestie, Miss Miss Westie, was a whole ass squirting queen escort in Dallas that wouldn't let her John turn the light on. I bet you didn't know. We didn't either. It was a shocker. It was a shocker. Oh, I'll have to send you some of those old lives that I've got privated. You will thoroughly enjoy them. Anywho, I think if I'm not mistaken, and Jules already declares she's canceling her birthday party. Well, that's okay. We've got the backup. Lee, because it literally says the old Amber channel, you dumbass. It's because she doesn't have yeah. anything. Yeah. She is giddy now that she's got me. See what yeah. Amber. I don't know. She don't have me. Go find a okay. real life. She can have this yeah. dream. Her pseudonym was Amber Rain, hence the squirting. But, bitch, you don't bother me. You're irrelevant. You're irrelevant. She keeps saying that she has this wonderful life and she's doing all this stuff, but then yet she's giddy yeah. over us. Exactly. Like, how are you, how do you have a real exactly. life? Exactly. No. It takes a lot of talent to manage. Let me just tell you. That's why I have to do shit like stream while I'm driving. But I manage. I'm just one of those people that just figure it out. You know, you got a lot of shit to do. You just figure it out. You can you get in where you can fit it in. No pun intended, girls. Like I, you know, it, it's just, it's a, your real life is us. <laughs> it surprised me because I'm like I just shut my channel down. I didn't fucking die. I'm sorry to disappoint you, Brooke. I didn't die. Okay, I still live. Oh come on, Amber. Nobody wants you to die. Then who would we laugh at? Still breathe. Yeah, she's uh, hoping you come back so she has some uh, content. Well, she some content. Hold, hold your breath. Some content. So, oh, Sophie, Sophie with a fucking permanent O face. Oh, oh, Sophie always has a face. Her mouth is always in the shape of an O, and I think that's because she's. I, I don't know why she's doing it. When it ain't crooked, it's an O. But anyway, Sophie, some content. So you're annoying. I can get on here and talk about anything. You're the most. Uh, anyway, anyway, get you some content. I don't need no, I don't need fucking Amber. That shit is played yeah. out. Uh, especially after they pretended they were my father mm-hmm. in a message. And she's going to be like, I didn't do it. Your friends did it. And you know, you're in a group chat. Yeah. And you guys all but, laugh. Okay. So here's my thing. And, and listen, I will totally take this for the team because God knows when it was happening to me and everybody was making fun of my little sandwich board. Fuck you, Brooke. If you think you can't get a pizza, you sure the fuck can. It's not me sending them. Oh, now that you mentioned it, old Red, it's funny you should mention that. It's really funny that we get pizzas bombarded and you decide to reemerge and take a panel. That's real funny. That's what a coinky dink. You might want to check back to the original source. Thank you. Get you a freaking no delivery sign. Make fun of me all you want to, but I bet you wish you had one now, don't yep. you, bitch? Yep. 
Shut up, Sophie. Of course, of course, Sophie's going to bring in all that she knows to bring into the table is a yep or a huh or a mm-hmm. Yep or huh or mm-hmm. That's all she got. So, and you know, I mean, you've made fun of John getting shit. You've made fun of uh, Jules getting shit. And it was always us doing it to ourselves. So if we're not doing it to ourselves now, what makes you think that we think that you're not doing it to yourself? I think she's doing it to herself. Exactly. For it sucks, doesn't it? Exactly. It sucks being blamed for some bullshit that you know you're not doing yourself, right, Brooke? First of all, Sophie, you flat earther, you don't get a decision in the decision, or you don't get an op uh, an opinion, okay? Because you're a flat earther, therefore your credibility is shit. But to say that I would wake up with two of my little boy's friends spending the night sleeping in my living room, which is right by my front door, why in the world would I wake up out of a dead sleep and call the police on myself so I can have content? Are you kidding me? Honestly, I think you're doing it to yourself. I think it's your group. I think yeah. it's your friend. I probably am pretty sure it's probably fucking Muzz because God knows she's a fucking weirdo. No, I think it's Penelope still. I think Penelope is just having a ball because Penelope is still. That's true. Yeah. yeah she, she only got a slap on Penelope the wrist and they're still her friends. Girl. So, yeah. Who Sorry, is, I'm just who, who, hey, hey, Slophy, who the fuck is Penelope's friend? If I ever see any of my friends talking to Penelope, I, we're going to have problems. Okay. Who in the fuck is still friends with Penelope? She grosses me the fuck out. If I, uh uh. So, that's first of all, Jules, you're wrong. It wasn't me and my group of friends that used your dad's number. I'm sure like I'm calling not only my town when they can't get my town anymore. Now they're calling the next town over that that's still in delivery range. I can promise you, especially since the one that showed up yesterday, I wasn't home. For, I can promise you I'm not doing it to myself. But now that you're blaming me for that, when you know, I would never do some shit like that. Both of you that are saying it, well, excluding Sophie, because all she did was, with one of my subs that decided to hop on my panel one day that decided to make her own channel. And here we are. So, yeah. but you other two know me and you know, I wouldn't do that shit. What up? Because I just, no, I thought it was it. so funny how giddy she got. She's going to do a stock account. No, Brooke, how much does a gram weigh, you dumbass? I, it says the old Amber channel. Oh, my gosh. That was fucking hysterical. Like, what kind I of stuff am I? With your a gram weighs a gram. But, but, but did y'all know what I understand? I meant how I didn't know if it was measured in grams. I didn't know if it was that kind of a quantity or if it was less than. I'm sorry. Anybody that wasn't, is it, wasn't stupid would understand the reason, what I was, how I was asking that question. Uh, Y'all are now you're another one Amber to go up there and say how much does a gram weigh? What color is a white pony? She doesn't know what a gram yeah. is. Oh, what, what kind of sock am I literally when it says the old Amber channel? <laughs> how much does a gram weigh again? Brooke? A gram. You're so stupid. You're so stupid. I, I pray for your patience. I can't. Thank you, Roberto. Thank you, Macy. <laughs> yes, I just wanted to come up because, you know, it, it does suck, right, Brooke? It did suck, I guess. What was it? The other night she got a 130 police department call. Yeah. And woke everybody in the house up. Remember when you had D do that to me, Brooke? Remember mm -hmm. that? Karma's coming oh, around. Oh, didn't it? 1.30 in the morning. No, actually, that was me that called. I called because you were singing the fucking Freddy Krueger song in my text messages. I remember it like it was yesterday. That was Brooke that called your house at 1.30 in the morning because you were texting me. One, two, Amber's coming for you. Three, four. What the fuck ever you were saying? I said text, cuckoo. Everybody in my fucking house. D, I believe D also called that night, but I told them not to send anybody out. I don't remember how that went exactly. I think we both called it only one time you got a knock knock, but I'm sorry. Don't be fucking threatening me and expect not to get some kind of an intervention, especially when you're an hour and a half away from me. But again, Brooke, don't call them on yourselves because that's what you said I did. Remember? 
stupid well no i think it i really do think it was the neighbors it probably was i think she wasn't paying attention to the sleepover party it probably was but it, that's what i'm saying like you know know. know all these months and years and whatever it's been jewel sending them to herself me sending them john okay well them. i know exactly the voices of all my neighbors and it would only be the ones either in front i'm assuming or on either side i can promise you it's not I'm pretty sure my one neighbor on the left is out of the country and has been. And I'm also certain that my other neighbors that I'm very pretty close to don't, would never ever call the police. Any of our neighbors would come to our front door before calling a police on me. So go ahead and try it. Go ahead and say, whoever called, get, go ahead and get the audio. The, we're waiting on the FOIA as we speak. All right, so I'm not going to be able to pay such as much to comments. All right, I think I, I don't. I, no, no, no. And and all the time, what we do know for a fact is, Brooke, is that you did want someone to post an ad for Jules on a billboard, send them in droves. Yep. You did have D call, and you still do. Yes, and and you did have D call. The if I really call. wanted D to do that, when she asked me for your address, I would have given it to her right then and there, and I didn't. I avoided it. I said, I have to go find it. And then she asked for it again. And I gave her another excuse. If I really wanted that and wasn't just blowing off steam and talking shit, I would have given the address. Now, wouldn't I? On me that night. Um, the pizzas were showing up. And now all of a sudden, everybody's getting the same text that John and I both have compared Similar text to, uh, but now it's, uh, what is it? It's the other people in her, her little group. Right. She's getting text messages, vile text messages yeah. about your kids. And yeah, remember the one about my son in my garage? With that the they said that you sent to yourself? Yeah. So I sent all of those to myself too, right? It's funny that we could all get together and, and probably come down to the main one with all the police departments, but. I don't give a fuck enough about Brooke or anything around her to even. When it is her and her friends that do real life stuff like vault driving. Yeah, I get it, Amber. I'd probably be a little upset if I told the whole internet, if you told the whole internet that I was a self-proclaimed squirting queen of Dallas and embarrassed the fuck out of you for it. I'd have a little, there'd be a little distinction there for me too. So I get it. I get it, girl. Exactly. Sending people to see was That's your side. And that, and the police see that shit. I'm over it. Like she can. I mean, I, I'm so glad I made your day yesterday, Brooke. Like, Gideon's voice was just disgusting. Like, oh my god, you. Yeah, and that is the dumb. Oh, that we are all jealous of. We are all completely jealous of that. So jealous. <laughs> Oh, Dolly. All of those letters behind her name does not mean she has a good life. What's crazy to me is I've never fucking said you, any of you were jealous, ever. That comes from you. Y'all are the, they, she thinks we're jealous. Like you have a sign to this shit. I have never said that y'all are jealous of me. Not that I can recall anyway. I think I've always said, uh, I mean, everybody has their problems and, you know, I've got, Things that I struggle with too. There's not a lot to be jealous of, to be honest. You're like somebody that's like a saint or a, a, a celebrity that's not like a bad celebrity. <laughs> I don't even know how to put that. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody that does good in the world that's got, you know, I mean, not that I don't. I'm just saying somebody of a higher status, a politician. Oh, that's a politician is a bad example. Um, just somebody of a higher status, you know, those are the people to be jealous of. I, I'm not, I'm, I can honestly say since like maybe elementary school, middle school, may, maybe high school, I don't think I've ever been jealous of a peer. I think that you lose that kind of tendency or that mindset, like when you're a teenager at the very least. You know, because I, I can honestly say I'm not jealous of any of them. Um, and I can honestly say there, there's no reason for them to be jealous of me. Oh, Those me. letters have not done her once. And I told you before, she's only book smart. She is not street smart. Not even book smart. She's she she a can't. Idiot when it comes to How much is a gram? A gram? 
yeah, that was hilarious. Oh my god! Uh, you know, when again, yeah. Check the little cocaine baggie. That's usually what they come in. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to like come up and because you know I know that oh, I'm yeah, under. I was just like, oh wow, it was so mm -hmm. funny that she was so giddy. Mm -hmm. Cause she thought that you were back and she can not back some actual content again. Nope. Mm -mm. Nope. Sorry. Brooke didn't realize that she's laying the foundation to be. Do you know how many people are going to it? Never mind. <laughs> never mind, Brooke. Keep doing what no, you're doing. Keep sending those secrets to yourself and calling the police on yourself. Feels good, don't it? Yeah. Oh my god, dude! Can y'all rub a brain cell together? Can y'all rub a brain cell together, please? I uh, see. This is just stupid. Y'all are just saying shit to say shit. If that makes you fucking liars, okay? How does it feel being told you sent yourself something? That means that you're saying it as if you think I really did. Anyway. No, I still think it's Penelope, and I think she's still laughing at it because she still hates Brooke, but they think that she oh, likes Oh, of course. Her. Of course. Yeah. Penelope is a shifty mofo. Yeah. 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 I don't care. I mean, it's like my life has been so peaceful. It's I love it. I oh, I bet. I love it. I bet, Amber. I don't know. Yeah, I know. Who really wants this shit? It, nobody, really. Like, seriously. Nobody. And... Brooke oh does. yeah, she does because she doesn't have anybody else um, at home. No, she doesn't have anything else in her sad pathetic exactly. life. Yeah. Even though she says she does, but she well, doesn't. I wouldn't trade it for a day in the life at my brokest, most one. No, nope, but she'll let it ruin her oh, marriage, yeah. her family, mm -hmm. everything. Nope. I got offline. Oh my God. If it, what if, what if our lives were determined by people like this that sat around and talked about your life? Like they knew what was going on or how things are, or how people feel or who you've got or what they want. Y'all are reaching. It's sad. Y'all are fucking funny. Sorry. Let me open up my phone. I can read some of these comments while my phone, my car is on drive assist. I don't have a channel. Does not mean that I died, Brooke. I'm sorry. Like, seriously, like the giddiness in her voice yesterday to find out that I was still breathing was disgusting. You're a disgusting person to think that somebody. I wonder if she um, is completely behind her friends making a spoof text uh, pretending to be my dad. Oh, yeah. Right I'm that? telling you, the, the text that me and John um, were comparing. Literally, were verbatim, almost. Yeah, they were like identical, and the punk, the crappy punctuation. It was like identical. Yes. Yeah, except mine included kids, and my grandmother, and my mother, and their addresses, and their phone numbers, and their whereabouts, and blah blah blah, and my kids hanging from like, oh my god! But yet now it's so sad because her side's getting it. Really. Somebody's playing her son, her side, her son, her son's on no, a her phone, side, he? her side. Is oh, her side. Yeah. But what I'm saying is like, you know, we could all get together and probably file a collective police report, but I just don't care enough. <laughs> like, honestly, like I would love to send you every single email, every single text message. So you could go forward and like find this nasty ass person, but I just don't give a shit anymore. Change your number. Amber, I don't ever need your help for a single thing ever in my life until the day that I die. Okay? Ever. Clock that. That's my best option and that's my best um, suggestion. Change yeah. your number. Everybody who's getting those text messages, change your number. No, I was thinking about that, but then I got worried because, okay, say I change my number. Then can't. All right. Well, I'm over, I'm over this one because. I uh, figured that Jules, at some point, she said that, that she's not having her birthday party. Uh, they ruined it for me. So what she really wants everybody to do is just beg her to please have the party.
date, maybe go over a surprise one. You know how this is going to roll. You know how this is going to shake out, but have no fear. We're going to be, a, we're celebrating across YouTube. It's our birthday week. So, in, um, to mark celebration of the eve of the bee's birthday, it's the queen bee's birthday. We are going to listen to whatever we can get through of the flip out video that we started two live streams ago. Shall we? Yeah, quit telling Jules to take the high road. She doesn't go low. No, they've they've deserted. They've deserved this for a very long time. Yeah, if Jules did pizza calls, don't you think that corn would have got one or whatever? Right. Never. Nothing like that happened. The only thing that ever happened with corn is I uh, and her police officer called me. I made mm -hmm. a report. Well, I mean, that's what anybody would have done. You know? Thanks, Shane. Now, should I get mean? Uh, Brooke, we got O Face Slophy on deck. Does it, Brooke, how would you feel if somebody was passing out your father's number? Hmm. If he were still here, how would you feel about that? Uh, how would you feel if people were putting your mother's number mm -hmm. on your pizza receipts? You skanky ass bitch. That does do drugs. I don't, that, oh my, you hear this bitch? I don't know. Why don't you ask the person that did it, Jules? Brooke, you mm -hmm. do. You know it. You know you damn well told me that you did coke. That is your jam. I you have like never. Others. So now she's just straight up making shit up. If I, if she was telling the true story, the true story would be, I've done it fucking once. It's something, I don't put shit up my fucking nose. So now we're, now we've, now we've morphed into the part of the live where she is just so bonkers that she's going to say whatever the fuck she wants to true, false or otherwise. But I guess that's kind of what she's been doing this whole time. She looks like the type. She is. She, that's because she doesn't think well unless she's hopped mm -hmm. up on uppers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep, it's obvious. Guys, I'm working on this texture art canvas. That's when that doing. happened, I believe it was 21 years old, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. It was 2001. Yeah, it would have been 21. Whenever the anger management tour with Limp Biscuit, DMX, and uh, 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 disturbed, wait, who was it? Anyway, it was that in Houston in 2001? That's what date it was. I can do a better solid and give you the date, the fucking venue, the year of when that shit happened. And I know if we ever had a conversation about that, that's the only story I would have told you because that's the only story I got. out and it's a lot harder than it looks i have like redone it like five times now it's not easy yeah this is fucked up no i wouldn't do that you know why because i am not some rich bougie bitch i've never been rich my family was always lower middle class middle class and we always lived mm -hmm. within our means i okay. never had anything fancy i never lived champagne taste on beer money no, never and that's why i know words. what a dollar is worth but mm -hmm. all of these entitled bitches over here acting like they have everything and they just throw money around. Yep. Think about business owners, you stupid fucking bitches. And if they had my address, I would be getting a pizza call right now too. Because I'm up here. So we have your address, but the p fact that we're not sending the fucking pizza, Sophie, don't get it twisted. Don't think you're off the grid. It's the fact that People that you would think that would do it, for some reason, they're not doing it to you. Or maybe they don't have your address. Here with you. Make sure JY reports this to his lawyer. I agree. Yes. Hey, JJ. Hi. Hi, JJ. Hi, Hi everybody. Listen, Dolls, anybody that is, like, honestly, the fact that anyone would come after a 90 something year old man they really. lost his wife they lost his wife he's not in the greatest health right now mm -hmm. exactly we're really in the best lost his wife not exactly not in a good time space and how dare anyone anyone it, it is it's beyond sick it's somebody without morals and what account did that you know who said they're calling your dad because i didn't hear that no it didn't they didn't say calling my no, dad it's it's like, oh god jj okk uh, is on panel now 
I just got a pizza delivery and they used my father's phone number. And so basically that's, we know your dad's number. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Oh my God. That is so disgusting. Because all of the other, all of the other times I've gotten deliveries and stuff like that, they use one of the old numbers that they used to know was mine or they use some fake number. This is the first time they've ever used my father's fucking number. They are so bothered, so bothered by the fact that, you know, you have that's a dad. That's just not happening to family. Exactly. Nobody's no, posting shit not. about their families. Exactly. Nobody's posting shit about their families, about their businesses. About JJ their literally just came up to say, they are so bothered that you have a dad. JJ. Um, so we don't roll like that. No, we don't. We call them out on their bullshit. That's and then it. her commentating all of it is making fun of the way people say words. Mm -hmm. But then she but then she thinks I'm stupid yeah. for saying you. It's so ridiculous. <laughs> but, Look, I love the way she even says it. Like, yeah, whatever she's trying to just say. She's even making fun of the way I say you like Anne. You know, but no, she has to do it. Uh, she has such a spaz. Jules, the spaz. Queen Bee. I don't know. We got to incorporate spaz. You're a spaz, dude. You, I cannot wait to do a parody of you, dude. You are a spaz. Oops. But that's the way she says it, though. I mean, <laughs> it wouldn't be happening right now if Brooke was not streaming this on Rumble and yeah. doing one of her little immature little little fits like she always does. Instead of showing people that she really, really has content, she's doing this. Guys, don't forget, I got a glitter bomb in the mail yesterday. A pizza today. Fucking what? Is there, are this shit coming to your house, Brooke? How would you feel if you got a glitter bomb? Now, thank goodness I didn't open that motherfucker. Am I right? She would have because she loves gifts. Now she won't because I've showed everybody what they look like. 100% so intimidation. Shut Listen up. to her. She loves gifts. How the fuck would you know? You've never given me one. Huh? You are the one you're talking about yourself again, Jules. You're the one that loves gifts. You're the big baby that can't fathom me going live and taking away your birthday. This has only become a thing because you realize that I've made money off of all y'all's birthdays and you get pissed. It's about the fucking money. It isn't about the day. It isn't about the stream. You just are afraid that I'll make more money than you do on your birthday. That's what it's about. That's why John was so bad, okay? Y'all are disgusting because just doing something like this and all it does is it allows you to have a platform to exhibit your bad behaviors and you've already started doing it for days now. My birthday's ruined. Because we know your dad's number reported to the police. Yep. Yep. Wow. Yes. I, I would. Sorry, I would say I am a witness in this case. I have not testified yet, and for months now, I have been. I'm. In, I've been intimidated. This and this and this and this has happened to me. I mean, yeah, like, I, I, if there's anything that I get incensed about, you know, okay. like, even at well, Christmas time, you know, a lot of people. There's going to be a problem with that report because you're reporting the wrong people doing it. So, like, I mean, I, I guess we're going to have to run this in the ground as many times as I've had to tell stupid Siwa. Oh, I forgot to get into that, that she went live. It's because she's, yeah, we'll talk about her last or later. Uh, but anyway, because she's really starved over there for attention. Like, she's really hungry and thirsty and all the things. Uh, what was I going to say now? Damn it. But anyway, what was I going to say? Now I forgot. Hold on. Play this. Donate. To the toys for tops which is understandable little kids mm -hmm. you know they should get something like I, I, if testified yet and oh that was what i was gonna say so you're barking up the wrong tree if you call and report that you're gonna be lying and i mean i'm sure that we could all hand over our phone bills with itemized times on them to show we didn't call any pizza place at the time that your shit was made your order was made to verify it was nobody from over here For months now, I have been, I'm in, I'm being intimidated. This and this and this and this has happened to me. I mean, yeah, like, I, I, if there's anything that I get incensed about, you know, like even at Christmas time, you know, a lot of people they donate. Breaking news: PMR's coming home strong with four voodoo dolls. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Which is understandable. Little kids, mm -hmm. you know, they should get something. But I, my Thank husband you, and I, we do for elderly. The elderly, you That's know, that are in homes. Mm -hmm. And you know what they ask for? It's so Yeah, sad. but making a report is important, Camden. Yeah. Even if I don't know who it is, making a report is, is making making a notation of this event mm -hmm. is. That's important because it's harassment. Mm -hmm. It really is. But regardless, you know what? I just don't. 
it, it incenses me to think that people would use an elderly man in his yep. 90s who just lost his wife mm -hmm. as a weapon. It's mm -hmm. disgusting. And I'm sorry, anybody who- I have to agree with JJ, OKK, uh, Cray Cray, whatever the fuck her name is. Uh, I have to agree with her. That is disgusting. If so, I, I would, that's something that would never cross my mind to do to somebody, okay? As, especially uh, for somebody that doesn't have her father. Like, I just don't, I would never do that. Ever. And neither would any of my friends. And I promise I'd be privy of it if they did do it. Because doing that really needs to look at themselves and reevaluate some things because that's yeah. not normal. And, and the I, people that support the people that's doing this, you yes. need to check yourself as well. Exactly. I would never. And like I said, I'm finding out. I am. I, I promise y'all. And I don't um, break promises. I don't. I am finding out who exactly is posting um, my business or talking about my home what? and things on Reddit. I'm finding out who you are. There's no doubt. I contacted five businesses, which my attorney gave me. I contacted five. Three of them can do it. And at nine o'clock tomorrow morning, and I mean, I even sent my friends proof because I don't want anybody thinking I'm lying or I'm just, you know, blowing smoke up their ass. I'm finding out who posted it. I am. And I am going to let everyone know. So Trash Box Hooker, La Rosita, and all of you who think it's cute, private things like that when it uh, but she's already I contacted did. somebody camden and they know how to do it i did yep sure did i contacted five and three of them can do it three of them um two of them couldn't uh, they told me right off when it comes to reddit they could not mm -hmm. tell me um mm -hmm. but three of them said absolutely they can That's and awesome. i have proof of that so and tomorrow morning i am contacting them and i'm going forward with it and i'm going to let everyone know who exactly these people are so, Jules, if you have somebody that you want to know because they've done some shit, or Sophie, even Cindy, I will absolutely put these people on the job because I'm not playing anymore. You can't do that. You can't. Okay, so then what was your findings? Have you gotten the findings yet? I mean, it's not like they got to go stake out Reddit. They have to just get into their system. What's the process for that? And what were your findings? Let's know. Sorry, I would never waste money on any of this, let alone using think of using oh, exactly the 11 yes it's on my rumble that's what i'm listening that's where i'm playing it uh i don't think that's easy but i hope she does find out i hope she does too maybe it will open up maybe it will open up to who's doing it to all of us because i guarantee you it might not be the same person but i, I guarantee you it's a group of people doing this and unfortunately, Penelope, Zeus, et al., y'all are all being looked at. Amber coming out of the woodwork today. Now you're being side-eyed as far as I'm concerned. Um, and Siwa, you too. I, I'm sorry. I'm looking at all of you. But mainly, Geneva, we know that you're sick. Sherrington, we know that you're sick. And I'm sorry, but it takes a sick-minded individual to do some of this shit and to say some of this shit. I get on here and the only thing I do is give opinions. I don't, I don't do any of this behind the scenes bullshit. So we I give opinions of what they do online, right. not what they do in their real life. Exactly. We don't do that. I don't care about their real lives. I no. don't know about it. I'm not spending my time looking it up, but they've done it to me only because I share my opinions and they're bothered by it. I never once ever, ever said that I'm wealthy, never. I said I'm comfortable, mm -hmm. and I am. I'm a normal middle class. And you worked your ass off to be comfortable. Yes, yeah, they have no idea. It wasn't all. given to you, you worked your ass off. And the only reason there's a clip of me saying wealthy bitch is because I was repeating fucking Siwa calling, saying you're not wealthy, you're not wealthy, or whatever the fuck she was doing to me. So that's why there's a clip of me saying it. But JJ, stop it right now. You're the braggiest person I've ever seen online, ever. Okay. What? Yeah, no. Yes, for certain, nothing was given to me. In fact, my family thought I was crazy for putting my entire savings into opening a business. They did because I had two kids and I was on my own as a mm -hmm. single mom. They have their dad. You know, I don't, I do, I, I feel like I need to say that because their dad is a great dad. You right. Know? So right. I don't, but regardless. But you were their primary caretaker. Yes. I was. I was their primary caretaker and kind of still am, even though they're young adults. But regardless, you know, I don't look at their dad as somebody bad. Like, mm -hmm. there's no 
like there's nothing there's nothing scandalous nothing so they want to come for i guess my business and i've always said um i have three babies i have my son my daughter somebody in my, my business life. you okay yeah, you know, well, just Lori asked me who was calling me over and over. Somebody in my personal life. I told you guys, there's something going on in my personal life right now that is not, I'm not having the greatest day. And then I wake up to all this bullshit. Great point, Maria. Yeah, that's what we do too. We give opinions and hold you accountable. We don't do send pizzas and do background checks. Sorry, barking up the wrong tree. I think you had it right. I don't have time to do all that shit, nor is it necessary. The person I'm fucking fighting with, I've been fighting with for years, okay? And furthermore, I don't think anybody can talk about looking up shit on anybody, et cetera, et cetera, JJ, after what's been done to me by the very people you're sitting next to. Yeah, so bullshit. People want to tell you what your life is. And but yeah, Brooklyn. yeah, just like they're trying to tell me what my life is just because they don't like me and that they would what they're saying that they think my life is like is what they wish it was like. OK, they hope the worst for me. And that's why they're saying all this stuff. They have. No, I mean, Jules has a clue and everything she's saying is bullshit. Yeah. The, I, the times that we me and Jason have argued, maybe I told her. But it wasn't fucking every day or often. And I promise we're in a much better place now anyway. Than when me and Jules were friends. Who was actually on parole, probation, whatever, and had black eyes. And we have a recording of her breaking out the windows of her house, but she did nothing. But I don't, what I don't understand is the police told Brooke that it was neighbors who called on her last night. So what? why is she not believing Oh, really? That? Wait a minute. Are you kidding? No, I'm not kidding. She said it. It was neighbors. So maybe it was, maybe her, maybe her son and his friends with the sleepover were getting rowdy in the yeah, listen, let me tell y'all all this. Let me tell y'all who's the one that told me that it was the neighbors. Because I still have not even watched the stupid door cam. It was Jason that told me he said the cops said it was the neighbors. We will see what the FOIA says, okay? Because I know it wasn't the fucking neighbors. Whoever it was said it was my neighbors. But I promise on everything, it was not my neighbors. So we'll see what the FOIA says. Everybody settle down. Seven to ten days. Seven to ten days. From Monday. Neighbors call the police. Oh, yeah. please FOIA request that. Somebody please get that recording. Yes. Yeah, Remember how they said it? And I, I assure you, that call, that 911 call on me, that was not my neighbor. Right. 100 and a million fucking percent. She oh said, isn't that funny? Isn't right that funny on. that Jules is like, that uh, That reminds me, that one that they called and said that they were my neighbor, it was not my neighbor. Really? Isn't that weird that somebody's calling my police station now and telling they're my neighbor and it's not my neighbor? However, Jules, come on now. She said that, but then quickly went into, you know, excuses of how it could be other people. And that the neighbor said that their house was really loud and rowdy. Because, and that, because my house wasn't loud or rowdy. There were two adults sleeping in the master bedroom and three little boys in my living room. Laying down with a movie on. The lights were out. The doors were locked. That was it. No rowdy, nothing. So that's how I know it wasn't a fucking neighbor. Because I know my neighbors, A, aren't going to call the police on me at all unless it's an emergency, a true emergency. Or B, they're definitely not going to call and make up some bullshit. So he was having a sleepover. Yes. Well, it was a good So why, why look at us for anything? I don't know. She why did she pay attention to her own family last night instead of being online? Exactly. You know what's funny? Did she get offline when the police came or did she stay online? Um, she said that, uh, gosh, where did I hear this on? I heard this, oh, on Heidi Extreme. It was Heidi's. I'm not even subscribed to Heidi, but a friend told me it was going on, so I went over there, and yes, on Heidi Extreme, she said that it was a neighbor who called on her, and of course, you know, they went into excuses of why it's probably not a neighbor, it's probably somebody else, which is ridiculous to talk to you with a neighbor. Yeah, but see, here's the thing, Camden, you have freedom of speech, but you still I need to be held accountable for what you say. You can say Okay. Again, I know my neighbors. I know they've never called the police on me at my house or my kids or my husband or any of us in 12 years. I know that they, listen, y'all, you can sit there and manipulate and, and be skeptical. I know my neighbors. I know that one is out of the country. It has been for a couple weeks at the very minimum. I trust me. It was not my neighbors. Now, 
Do I put it past them to have Googled and looked up addresses next time to find my neighbor's names and call and say it was them? Not at all. But then I can also go right next door, uh, depending, hopefully it's the my neighbors uh, on the right. right. So I can go right next door and let y'all compare voices. Because you know I'll do it. I'll do anything to prove myself. Don't get it twisted. Say what you want, but you can get held account for it. Yeah, it's our so freedom of speech, but it's also, you have consequences for your speech. Exactly. Exactly. Brooke can't control herself, so how can she control anyone in her house? Exactly. So exactly. Brooke said she was sleeping, um, that she left the Rumble Live going. What? Because I don't She's a liar. Why she left the Rumble Live going, but she- I always leave live. the Rumble Live going, especially if I'm not talking. That's not the, I mean, the last time, or one of the last times I left it going, Reagan had to turn it off for me because I fell asleep. If I'm not, I'm usually, typically, really just streaming this over here to save the shit and to give other people a place to chat. Of course I went to sleep. I do it all the fucking time. Going, so that way people can still chat, whatever, whatever. And that she went to sleep and that her son and her son's friend came in her bedroom door screaming that the police were there. Oh my gosh, and so wait a minute. So she was asleep, so it probably was her son and his the friends that were being too loud and that's probably what the police were called for. I promise you, you wanna know why it's, it wouldn't take the neighbors to call the police if, my, if those kids were being that loud? Because my husband would have gotten up and handled it. Me, I can sleep through anything, but Jason cannot. Jason wakes up at the drop of a dime. I'm a very hard sleeper. I promise you, I mean, even when Christopher is alone and falls asleep on the couch watching TV on the weekend, with the TV not even that loud, and the TV wasn't loud the other night, Jason still gets up in the middle, uh, and not even in the middle, probably a couple hours after he goes to sleep and turns the TV off. I Because it wakes him up. I promise you, they were not being loud. I had made sure they were laying down and situated before I got my ass in bed. Yes, so wait a minute, she, she left her life going on rumble, went to bed with yes. her son and the sleepover still going and them yes. nowhere near going to bed. That's what she said. Wow. That's nowhere near going to bed is lay, not lay, laying down pillows and blankets and popcorn and, and waters and watching TV. It's not, I mean, they, they're, they're well-behaved little boys. What she said, but they went on and on as if it's somebody in this community that must, must have called it is on her it must have. Girl, no your, your neighbors okay how about this how about them. when i know how my the, the the status of my house and i know it was quiet as a mouse and i know it wasn't no loud rowdy shit going on i know it wasn't my neighbors because my neighbors would have never called a fake fucking call to my house at 1 30 in the morning but people in another time zone sure could have. We said it was your neighbors. Like, what the hell? Why did they say that? If it was probably because she got drunk and she went to bed and uh, bed. and her it wasn't paying attention to her own household. Mm -hmm. Can you believe that shit? Oh, somebody please listen. spoil that call. I need to yes, hear that please. fucking call. Yeah, go listen. It's on Heidi Black's channel. She said that. And, and you have the nerve to blame like, other people. Yeah. All of the yeah. bullshit comes from your camp, Brooke. You are the one <laughs> that sent somebody to see what sister to house to take a picture. You had Vault go past my house and record it or whoever. I kind of I think it wasn't Vault. I think Vault just posted I didn't have put that anybody up to that. I didn't put Vault driving by your house. I didn't tell her to do that. I didn't know until after it happened. Dude, I'm so sick of this shit. You you guys just want it to be me so bad you can taste it. I'm I hate to break it to you. I think they had somebody else do it. Mm -hmm. Right, and they keep blaming Johnny Mac for going by coaches. Johnny will give us. And there's no proof of it. Get the fuck out of here. He well, the worthless eyeball is busy talking a bunch of shit because she has no content of her. I own. love the way when people, and by the way, well, I'm going to take this moment right now. Sophie, I'm going to teach you something right now. Maybe you can, maybe you're still able to adapt to learning. Whenever you say the sentence such as, <clears throat> hey, I went over there and I saw a bird. I don't know. I'm just making up a sentence. Or, I was outside at the park yesterday and I saw, and I see, I saw someone riding a bike. That's correct. You're not supposed to say, I was outside walking yesterday and I seen a bird or I seen this. 
I seen that. It's saw. Learn the word saw, Sophie, and everybody in y'all's chat that says scene two. What the? I, that is a pet peeve. Saw. Her own. And I just got a pizza. This is why I'm upset right now, John. I got a pizza delivery while I was live. And um, they used my father's phone number. That's why we're here. It is just like the people that were doxing my family members in the chat the other day. This is their way of showing me they have my father's number. And I'm going to tell you this right now. My family is protected. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. mine as well. And, you know, I I've already talked to all of them. And I don't have... Jules lied to the cops about Jen. What are you yeah. fucking talking about, Jen? Go away. This is Jen. Oh, God. I blocked Jen and I blocked her from StreamYard, so she's having a fit, so she's coming in. Jen, I didn't lie to know any police about you, you fucking freak. I got a FOIA request about you and they called you 1096. Go away. <laughs> Jen, hey, go hey, to AMZ's channel. She's mm -hmm. the only one that wants you to speak. That's it. Because you're crazy here. To, guys, so you guys now know the green goblin is Jen. But yeah, mm -hmm. my elderly father in his 90s. You guys think that's funny? That's, that's Brooke, how would you, Brooke, how would you feel if your father was alive today and people were um, putting his phone number on your pizza request? Again, I want y'all to make sure y'all understand that when people like Jules bring up stuff like this that makes it sound like it's an innocent statement to make, and, or like, how would you how would you feel, Brooke, if this, that's not what she's doing it for. She's bringing up my dad because she knows for a fact, because I've told her this before, I don't like people bringing up my father for any reason. So she's doing it. Because you're nasty. At least your dad's still alive, Jules. Why don't you go spend some fucking time with him, sicko? Oh, that makes you some type of way, bitch. Shit. I mean, you know why? Why? It's so necessary. Like he, and you know, I think Lewis has something to do with this. Oh, Lacey. I, I think he has something to do with this because he was the one, isn't he the one that was giving out your family's names? Well, no, he said, he's like, oh, he's like, and then people, you know, are doxing Jules' brothers and stuff like that. I never said it was my brother. No, I never heard you say never that. Never said it. No. Never said it was my brother. No, you didn't. No. Nope. Not until afterwards. So somebody said, Jules, was that your brother? And then I paused, like, wait a minute, I didn't say that. No, you mm -hmm. didn't. And I heard your lies and you didn't yeah. say it. So that no, was really over there, they have expendable income and they can just throw money around on steak every day. And they laugh at the people starving on the streets. They think it's right. funny. And they, they, they make fun of me. Starving. And they make fun of me as if I make fun of people who are like, don't have the means, don't have a lot of money. I would never. That is so far from mm -hmm. who I am. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. The only reason I ever said, you know, that this bit of my house. JJ, you don't have to say nothing, Cray Cray. You don't have to say nothing. It's all about your flaunty ass, bragging ass hopes about your belongings and your makeup and your all this haul and look at these thousands of jillion. You don't have to say nothing. Your posts are braggy. Is because Maria was trying to shame me as like a you're not rich. This is what your house is worth kind of deal. And it's like, bitch, I my, my husband and I live below our means so we can travel and take care of our two young adult kids and help them and we help our parents like it's gross that they look into these things it's gross gross i, I can't even imagine wanting to do that to someone anyone no if for, for brooke to sit there and get upset oh wait no wanda that one was okay wanda we're, that one's fine hold on a minute don't time that one out i am fine with this this account can stay in here as long as they want so wanda don't time this one out i'm gonna retime it out for 10 seconds yeah, dirty cooch deserves absolutely no grace. So don't, don't here's disgusting. the thing, Wanda, don't time out any, nobody time out any of these sock accounts because as of today, I don't care. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't care. Because they, they have sock care. accounts of my ex-boyfriend mm -hmm. in all of their chats. They mm -hmm. have had the fucking stinky ass beetle in their chats all the time. So I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. The Carlos account of uh, and Maria, that's fine because you let Glenwood in your account. So I let, I let that. So you guys just, it all, it's fine. I don't give a fuck. Unless it's one of the words that are banned, I don't care. So yes, dirty cooch is allowed in here because cooch is very dirty. She's disgusting. A she's a pig. Honestly, she's a pig. And she's but also, I want to also say that here's what I also know about Jules is when she goes crazy for cuckoo pop or cocoa for, I'm sorry, cuckoo for cocoa pops like this, she'll do anything to get even. She will go low of the low of the low. So trust and believe my eyes are wide open at you, Jules. And don't think that somebody else is going to get the blame for any of the shit because you've already dropped too many breadcrumbs making little, making little, uh, uh, you know, what is the word I'm thinking of? Bah. You know, subliminal, subliminal threats, subliminal threats. You've already made them. I already heard you about all the people that are going to do what, Jules. What you going to do to me? Trust and believe anything that happens from the last week on forward. I'm looking at you and it's going to be investigated as such to get money off of being an absolute disgusting pig.
And what not one of them has put forth any real content other than, yeah, she's very dirty and very smelly. Okay. Uh, and leave sweaty alone. And that, so you guys did, you were you in here when we said that now um, Maria is stating that sweaty is broke's nose. So she posted a picture of sweaty, of, not in a flattering picture, on her community tab. Does she have proof? No, because it's not. Exactly, dirty coach. I'm a pig, feed me. Gross. Oh my God. She yeah, and I didn't mean to sound awful. mean when I said that, but yeah, I am not giving any grace to those bitches because they've no. never given me any no. grace. No. I have had names blocked. I have had all sorts of stuff and I have put so much, I have so much fucking more respect. Not anymore. Out the window. Gone. Free for all. How many people have they blamed Brooke's nose on? <laughs> no, lot. I know. Exactly. So yeah. I watching at the time. No. A lot. And has Brooke's nose, like, um, put any confidential or private business out there on anyone? Nope. Nope. Just yeah. her opinion on what happens online. Like, we do. I didn't think so. I didn't think so. But I'm fine. Where is Brooke? I will be the panel right now. Yeah. That wasn't Maria that posted that picture of Sweaty. That was Anne. Get your facts straight. I mean, it's just. It's either y'all are really ignorant or y'all are just flat out liars, or maybe it's like a mixture of both. I don't know if Brooks knows wants to come up on panel, but sweaty, I mean, you can come on up if you want. I have the link, uh, I have the link pinned up there if you want to come up. That's fine with me. I don't know if Brooks knows well, but I know for a fact, and John knows, fucking Sophie yeah. knows, Brooks yeah. knows is absolutely 100 and a million percent. That's sweaty. Right. And Maria, this is why you're dangerous because you use your LLC, your platform, to spew lies. Mm -hmm. My okay, listen, I have an LLC. And why did I do an LLC? Because it's better for tax reasons. Oh my God. Every time JJ comes in to, to, to speak, I, me, what I've got, my home, me, my LLC, JJ, read the room. But what does that mean? It means that any partner or managing partner within that LLC is just as responsible. You become yes. one. And they need to understand that if they don't know that, they need to talk to their accountant. They need, I get it. Maria's supposed to be a tax person, whatever, but she obviously is not an attorney because when I was looking at what I wanted to do, I chose an LLC knowing that any managing partner that I accept on there, I am responsible for anything they do. So Maria, you're responsible for Anne's mouth and Anne, you're responsible for Maria's mouth. It's just the way that that's the law. I'm not making it up. It's the law. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's what I've been trying to tell them all along. You know, just because Maria's not on panel when Anne is trashing the hell out of Jules here, she's just as responsible. Oh, and Anne says that I don't know anything about the judicial system. So I guess Anne from Scotland knows everything about the judicial oh, system. Oh, she knows everything about the United States judicial system. Right. Yeah. And their LLC was filed for in the state of Florida. So I live in Florida. I was going to call, so like, I was going to say, shut up, shut up, O-Face Sophie. But now I figured, I'm just, we're, I think her new name should be Slow Face. Is that she does she always her mouth is always going oh oh she's she's trying to look like like her, her lips have filler or something i don't know what the fuck she's trying to do she holds her mouth in a oh oh i've only been paying attention for the last couple of days slow face okay that's where my llc is i know the law i know it very well and i'm sorry but anything that each other says they're responsible for and they can be very reckless in their mouth very and they're just it's like a lawsuit waiting to happen and i'm not saying i'm doing that i'm just going out there and looking hosting, yeah. you know my business door my business name like wow about they did all of that they did that yes so i will find out who they are there are three coming they said uh jj i see your lawyer and i raised you a whole pile of bullshit and I re-raise. Oh, they, they, they had to go live. Cool. Burn the mic. Oh my gosh. They couldn't. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. But are they taking the, the, the thunder away from uh, the eyeball? I guess so. I guess so. And the eyeball took the thunder away from us two days in a row. So. Wow. Yes. Please. Everybody, please report that post for bullying harassment. Yes. Because that is bullying and harassing one of our subscribers. Uh, sweaty. When we all know damn well. Broke's nose is not. It was a hundred and a million percent not. And you know what? Here's the thing. So, okay, we will have Brooke's nose prove and turn her camera on when Vault turns hers on. There you go. Yep. How about that? So don't you dare sit there and talk about people being anonymous when you have fucking Vault that there literally drives past people's houses, pokes at people. Hey, here's the deal. We know what Vault looks like. We know her name. You don't. That's your problem, not ours. And no, we're not ever telling Vault to release her uh, identity. That would be the stupidest move ever. Well, all day, every day, and stays anonymous. So fuck you. I know, just like you guys know for a fact, supposedly who Vault is, but you don't. Because Vault will never, ever tell never. anybody who she is because she knows that everybody turns on everybody.
That is the only way she has ever stayed anonymous is to never tell anybody everything, anything, because it always comes out in the wash. Yeah, look for the bald, sick lady. Can you imagine that? So uh, a compassionate nurse, how do you feel about that? Trying to look shame somebody who has nothing to do with this. I can't give my, my uh, opinion because I didn't see the picture or the post, so. JJ fell. I think she was having a bad connection. Wow. And so what in the world could their, what is their live titles? I'm not sure. I just seen it come across. And I'm sure I didn't like, I give a shit if Anna Maria go live while I'm streaming, not talking on rumble and doing other things at my house and laying out by my pool and cooking lunch for the kid, like whatever I was doing all the whole time I was, Oh, and I even went to Walmart while it was true. So y'all feel y'all are aghast that ever I went to sleep with the rumble plan. I went to whole ass Walmart and went shopping while it was going at my house. My top of my phone. Hold on. Uh, oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't be. Hashtag blame your subs. What? Oh no, no you, you don't. don't be. Hashtag don't blame your subs. Don't blame my subs. What am I blaming my subs for? I have no idea. You guys, what if I blame my subs for? Oh, about blaming. Well, Lewis, you guys, whoever sent me that video, that clip of Lewis stating that, I need, I don't remember who it was. Oh my goodness. Hold on, what is this? So that green goblin person left a message saying, can we see your toes? Jen, you're weird. Oh, here, JJ's back. I'm back. I'm so sorry. I don't know what. I've got to find that fucking clip. Um. Because literally Lewis says it. Lewis says that, oh, she's just mad. She's talking about her, her brothers. And nobody knew that was my brother. Mm -mm. Somebody came in here doxing my brother and using my brother's Facebook picture. <laughs> my other brother doesn't have a Facebook, so you won't find that. And you came in here, not even the, the name that we call my brother. You came in here doxing the name, like his, his name on paper. Nobody calls him that. You guys are disgusting. So if we were, uh, okay, here we go. I got it. I got it. Hold on. Here we go. Any savage, she can have as many cameras as she wants. She can sell her phone at the end of the day. It's already been proven. That if someone wants to get to you in a close usual, they can. They just didn't take the step to actually physically harm you because they knew the consequences because you're so many that's already shown that you'll go to the police and it wasn't worth it at that time. But you may yeah. find the wrong person. Yeah. Like I said, that has nothing to lose and they could do something to you. And I hope that doesn't happen because I'm not as bad as person as you think. But I also think you're putting yourself oh, in a position where you deserve it. Harm you. Uh, okay, Facebook. So you won't find that. I got it. Mm. I got it. Hold on. Here we go. <laughs> it's Amy and Savvy. She can have as many cameras as she wants. She can sell her neighbors are filming. At the end of the day, it's already been proven that if someone wants to get to you and get close to you, they can. They just didn't take the step to actually physically harm you because they knew the consequences because you're someone that's already showed that you'll go to the police and it wasn't worth it at that time. But you may um, find the wrong person. Yeah. As Amy said, that has nothing to lose and they could do something to you. And I hope that doesn't happen because I'm not as bad as a person as you think. But I also think you're putting yourself oh, in a position where you deserve it because of what you do to some of these people. And if you choose to bring me down the road that you've done to people of trying to dox and all this stuff and people already know my name. Like, like, like that, like guess what? I know the karma that's coming your way because people have already exposed your father's number, your um, sisters, yeah. your brother's address, and people are trying to show you that they're going to go that far. I'm Did you hear that? I have never seen wow. my father's number posted anywhere. I didn't even remember that. Yeah, sick. I've never seen my father's number posted anywhere until on this fucking receipt, Lewis. That's sick. Yeah, is is it ever like maybe they heard somebody say that? Who knows? I don't know where he saw what he saw exposed. Maybe he saw the name come in one of the chats and said that you're you're screaming it from the rooftops that that screen name went into another chat. He's saying he would hate for any of this shit to happen to you. And it was why would you be getting a pizza the next day or two days later with your dad's phone number on it? Like, why would, if he was going to do that, why would he even say anything like that he said in this live stream? It doesn't make sense. It's whenever you want something to be, it doesn't always happen. And I'm sorry, you can want all you want to blame anybody over here, but you're barking up the wrong tree. Wow. But here's the thing, you guys, I never said that. I never said uh, about my father's phone number. I never said that. Never Not talked about my today. brother. But somebody did one of those beetles did dox my sister and the rescue that she volunteers for can you imagine that my sister doing things out of the kindness of her heart volunteering and you're gonna dox her doctor wow her. you guys are fucking sick God, doxing dude. an elderly man well not they didn't really well i bet you you probably have doxed my father's number in some chats probably payback is a motherfucker and karma will get you all not me karma because you're the ones that aren't going to be able to sleep at night. I sleep like a bee. I do. 
after when I fell into the black hole. I, I mean, uh, what are y'all going to all do when you find out it's Geneva and or Sherrington doing this? What are y'all going to do? Because I'm going to bring it to y'all. Geneva, I'm, I thought you were leaving, by the way, boo-boo. You're still hanging out in chats. You ain't gone nowhere, sitting there playing a victim. When How hard is it for y'all to understand? There is nobody else in this community that would have a motive to go at daddy and PMR other than Geneva and possibly Sherrington, depending on what kind of strings she pulls and how close those two are behind the scenes. Geneva's friends with people, not publicly. I mean, Sherrington. Those and the shit that they were getting sent is repulsive. There's not even a word that I could find to use better than repulsive. And it just so happens to be when this bitch is going crazy doing this stuff to me too. Y'all are gonna, you're gonna be, you're gonna owe a lot of apologies when you find out the person that's doing it is your friend. That's last night. I went to sleep and I was like, yeah, I'm out. I'm mm -hmm. done. Well, yeah, I fell asleep listening again. If um, there's anybody that um, is messing with either of you two and you don't know who it is, just let me know because. I told y'all tomorrow morning I'm calling first thing. I even shared the, the return voicemails because I don't want to be deemed a liar in any way with all of my friends saying that, yes, they can do this, this company. So y'all on Reddit, like Reddit or YouTube, and you're trying to use these fake accounts or whatever, your anonymity is gone gone did i say that right and i'm in and i mean whatever. they have the i'm pretty sure on reddit you could make can you still i mean i think back in the day you could make a reddit account without an email I, like how the fuck are they what are they going to trace the ip what if they use a vpn like what do you have the cia on the case jj i'm confused and what was the outcome it's wednesday you were calling monday morning they have the you know right I mean. to freedom of speech and they can say whatever they can want, but nothing is ever anonymous 100%. No. Period, point blank. Police can find out, can all they you. have to do is pull records. And if it if mm -hmm. some, comes with money and to do whatever, it can be found. Now, the regular everyday person doesn't have money to do that. But like, Well, you, know. you let me know. And it's not that I'm like, and like I've said a million times, they call me wealthy because I give super chats and I, I donate and I help people. That doesn't mean I'm rich. No, it's because you brag. It, you brag. You want people to think you are if you're not. And you brag, JJ. It's not because of anything that we've thought up and put on you. Listen to you sounding like me. It's because of what you do. I've said a million times, I'm just comfortable. That's it. We live below our means. We are comfortable. And I didn't come from a wealthy family in any way, you know, I busted my ass. So fuck anybody that wants to try to shame me for that. And I will, I will, I am a- Hey, I can take that exact statement. I busted my ass and screw anybody that wants to shame me for that right out of JJ's mouth and put it on you and your friends, JJ. Yet y'all are all in the chat doing it. all hoorah whenever it's being done to me. Oh, she only lives in that house because her dad died. And no, I live in my house because I made an investment and I just happened to live in my investment. Who tore us through and through? I am loyal to a fault and I am also stubborn to a fault, which could be good and bad. But right now I am stubborn and I'm finding out who the fuck these people are. Because I'm done. I'm done. Because I'll tell you what didn't do me any justice after my dad passed away, was diversifying my funds and putting it in the stock, like putting it in diversified funds and all that. After the crash, I was guaranteed that that stuff was protected and blah, 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 slow yield, yada, yada, bullshit. So I decided oh, I'm not going to do this again. I'm not going to put it in the stock market again. I'm going to invest in something. And I invested in my home, which is now almost doubled in value. I don't get to put my business and tell people what it is and hope that they'll go there or do whatever based upon my opinions that have nothing to do with that mm -hmm. business. What the fuck is wrong with you people? No boundaries. Yep. Oh, well. 
When, yeah, when will anybody see us go and post a picture from somebody's family's Facebook or something or Never. anything? We don't do that kind of stuff over here. Uh, speak for yourself, Slofy. I've got so, or slow face. I've got so many text messages from Jules of her sharing all kinds of people's private fucking uh, social media accounts. Are you going to say anything, B? Are you going to chime in and say, yeah? Look. At least I don't. I don't look for people. No, I don't care. Exactly. I deal with the the account that is coming at me at the time. Yes. You know, like I don't yes. go looking for people. I don't. But right now, oh, I'm looking, bit. I am. And this is looking, different. And I'm going to find out. This, this is different. You don't get, get to post my business. Good, JJ. Why don't you do me a solid then and find out JY is horny for a Big Mac or a criminal that put my son in his underwear up on Reddit. So not what the exact account name is of it, but my home that I live in with my family and just think that that's okay. Because no one knows who you are. You Someone. It is. And she. and Britters. It's none of your bitch. Talking about it. As she said that she's going to do you go, I go. Every time I go live, she's going to go live, whether I'm talking about her or not. Mm -mm. How's it feel? How does it feel? I'm sorry. I know a lot of y'all aren't a big fan of music, and I haven't played that much. Treat me like you do. But I, I love that song. I love it. Dun, 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 Oh shit. Oh well. I, <laughs> I played the wrong fucking one. Y'all get the gist. <laughs> extra long extra long intro, sorry.
She is an absolute idiot, and I believe that the hair dye has gotten to her brain. Sorry, that was a that's a seven minute damn song. I guess I could have looked at that, and the intro is super long. But I played just the lyric video or the lyrics, whatever you know what I mean. The instrumental before. But anyway, how does it feel, Jules? Shut up! You have dug and dug and dug and dug and poked and poked for years now, multiple two years. You don't stop. Something did. That's but she's doing. just doing, and I'm telling you right now, Brooke, you, if you'll go up, when I decide I'm going to have my birthday stream, I'm not, I don't know if I'm going to have it on the date or I'm going to have it on next weekend. I'm not sure yet. Oh, um, that's funny. Cause I don't know if I'm going to have it on the day or the weekend either. Funny. Um, but if you go live at the same time, Brooke, the outcome will be the same as what happened with on um, John's birthday. Oh, you are going to poke and poke and poke and poke and poke until people get pissed off and hurt your feelings. Why would you do that? A ra I'm telling you right now, this is what's going to happen. So why would you not just let somebody have a birthday party and not talk about you? Because I assure you, you don't fuck with me. I won't be talking about you on my birthday because we know how to actually have a good time. Well, listen, I'm always up for a good challenge, Jules. Go ahead and do whatever the hell you've got to do to me. And I can't believe that you can't like sit on your hands or bite your tongue and not worry about what the fuck I do and deal with your own feelings and your own paranoia on your own birthday and let me do what I do over here. Cause it's funny. It's funny. Cause y'all act. I mean, to think that see what was more mature about this than you and John combined is hilarious. You know, Jules, if they come for you or start or do a competing stream on your birthday, it's only going to piss your subs off that will end up donating more to you. I don't, I don't care, JJ. Those subs that are going to get pissed off and donate to Jules, good. Jules needs it more than most people. And they wouldn't be the same subs donating it to me anyway. I don't care. I could give a shit less how much money Jules makes on her birthday. She's been begging for it all year. She better make something. Mm -hmm. And that's not a like, oh, it's going to make them mad if you donate to me. No, <laughs> this is the damn truth. If you do a competing yeah, line against Jules, you are going to piss off her subs and her loyal supporters that will give her an extra few bucks just to spite you for doing that. What is going on? What What is going on? Hold on. I still don't understand. Like her son was having a sleepover yesterday and the, and they were so rowdy that the police were called, please get that. I need to hear that voice. I need to hear that call, especially, you know why? Because I'm being blamed for it. How mm -hmm. embarrassing. Otherwise I don't give a fuck, but I'm being blamed for it. So I want to hear it. And I guarantee you did I out, probably the neighbor because I, she wasn't. Did I out and out blame Jules? I can't recall, but i Quit saying it was my neighbors when you don't know who the fuck it was. I know. I'm going to say it again. My house was not rowdy, Jules. It was the fucking opposite. So it was a fake call. Paying attention to her sons having a sleepover. And maybe it was because yeah, she was too busy listening to all this shit. You bet no, that the Rosita account is Penelope. She already said it. That she, that the cops told her. That it was a neighbor. Oh my goodness. Brokes, nose, and sweaty are going to come up at the same time. She says, all I'm going to say is I'm not sweaty and then I'm dropping. That is fine. <laughs> Guys, the link is the link is tagged. The link or the link is pinned. Come on up. Put it come to my sweetheart. 
So do you guys know how I was looking for the lion's mane mushroom in the grocery store and I couldn't find it? So I ordered it. And the only it reason, I, and see, I don't, I think I stopped watching this before it ended. So I don't really know what happens at the end, the end of this stream. But I do know that before I stopped listening to it, she got really nasty about sending my kids, uh, parents, letters and all kinds of shit. I'm going to make my own. My son's friend's parents. Well, it came in today. And I'm making mushrooms. <laughs> Not Wait, the magical what was kind. What came in today? Well, uh, I... Uh, a packet a pack to make lion to grow lion's mane mushrooms oh okay to grow them okay i got you mm -hmm. i must have missed that part on your live yeah to grow them to cook them yeah because so i've cool. been seeing a lot of interesting things so i'm really excited i don't like mushrooms them. at all i don't either why... i've always had mushrooms on pizza and they're disgusting Ugh. but i've seen some really good uh recipes so i'm I've got a question. What did Joel tell her chat just now? Was it just now? I'm so confused. I'm going to grow them and I'm going to try them. Okay, slow face. Them. Cool. I love them. It's it's kind of slow for you. Do this so Anne can shut up. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, yeah, do this. So Why? Is mm -hmm. Anne over there spouting off like crazy? Probably. And Marina, how many community. times have you guys been wrong about this? You have been wrong about this all the time. And guess what? This is being screenshot. This is showing. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at hey, cucumber here. Guess what, Joel? Guess what, Joel? You were wrong about who was sending the shit to. Do you forget? Do you forget? And Amber, for the record, I still think you sent yourself those fucking pizzas because Penelope never said she never sent you any pizzas. So you're not off the hook for that, Amber finger in the fish. Ew. I, I like this so much better. I'm married to someone I try to cheat on every time I see anybody of the opposite sex anywhere near me. Oh, what a fabulous life. Uh-oh, Sweaty's here too. Yeah, I, you come Hold on. I, gotta, I gotta switch my layout. I gotta go back uh -oh. to normal layouts. Hold on, here we go. We gotta go back to normal layouts because I'm adding more people. Sweaty is here. Dun, da, da, dun. Hey, got Sweaty. My She's muted at the moment. Hello, sweaty. Now we're just waiting for Broke's nose. Sweaty, are you there? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hello, everybody. I'll Johnny say hi. Oh, and here you are going. Johnny, it's so here. Sweaty is, oh. Okay, oh. wait, sweaty, just device disconnected. Hold on. She fell backstage. Because her device, that's probably why she wasn't connected right yet. Yeah, because you guys, I only have the special layout for five people. I only made it for five people. Because you guys, you can, hey, Dreadhead, no proof it didn't happen. What does that mean? No oh, about the, about the police call. Can you believe that? So, John, apparently last night she was busy paying. Oh, she just dropped. She's probably got to go to a different part of her house. Um, so last night um, after I dropped into the vortex, supposedly, I guess, the police were called to her house. The police told her that the neighbors called, uh, but she is blaming it on me. And, oh boy. Okay. So I mean, like, that's, not even, that's like not even uncommon. So our son's having a sleepover and they're probably getting rowdy. Like that's mm -hmm. kind of a big deal. Like I, that makes sense. No, but now oh my God. But y'all know my son. Y'all know how his temperament. Rowdy, a nine-year-old two two person sleepover doesn't get rowdy unless the parents allow the rowdy. Uh-uh. Like I said, I got off my live at 9 30. I commenced to finishing some stuff up around my house and picking up and putting those boys in the pit. I say in the bed, but on the couch, which our couches all recline out like they lay out flat. So anyway, that's why they were sleeping in there, watching TV on the big TV. Oh, it's my fault. So Brooks knows I see you backstage. I'm going to keep you back there until I see Sweaty come in and then I'll bring you back both up at the same time. So since it's the for all I know, they could have said, I'm going to get home and I'm going to watch that video. Of them at my door. I don't. I kept meaning to do it on damn Sunday, and then I, I totally forgot because uh, that's the kind of shit that I do all of the time, and I hate that. But it is what it is. I'm gonna go home and look at it and see exactly what was said, and I'll be sure and let you guys know. Just in the interim, until we get the actual report. The big yeah, broke nose is backstage. Sweaty, big reveal. Back. Yeah, sweaty. Go find a good connection. But yeah, I don't want to, because she only wants to, she says she's only going to say whatever. So, I mean, unless you want to come up now, you can write it in the private chat. But I don't know. I don't want to, I don't want to make you feel uncomfortable. But all of it, John, you know for a fact that she's not sweaty. Yeah. 
Brooke's nose has a very distinct voice and it's not sweaty. Okay, so. Seriously. I can Hello, ladies. Home. Hi, Jules. <laughs> okay, okay, is everybody here? I'm, I'm here. Okay, so you can sew. Okay, sweaty. Where'd sweaty go? Oh, oh my God. God. Sweaty, go get your devices connected. Sweaty, I even played the breaking news. And I'm just letting y'all know that after this, I'm going to end this stream because uh, I want, I'm want. i sure everybody wants to hear Broke's nose and Sweaty because I'm going to listen to and find the parts because we still have uh, two hours left, okay? And we don't need to be making this like a 50-part series, who the fuck did I marry, but on Jules. No, we have a party to do. We have a party coming up, several parties. We're going to be partying it up. Anyway, um, I'm going to stop it right there. And then I'm going to go find the really disgusting parts. And we'll highlight that on the next stream as well as see what's pathetic attempt to, to get Heidi Black's attention. Sorry, Heidi. I didn't mean to be one of the ones that blew you up. I was I was messaged and asked or told that you were going live, that you went live about uh, that. Heidi, sorry, see what went live about you, Heidi. And then I get messages. That, you better tell Heidi. So I just kind of, you know, texted you. I'm sorry. I blew your phone up. Or I was one of the... Contri uh, contributors to your phone being blown it. Sorry about that. Um, but yeah, so tell me you're not desperate for somebody to talk shit on you without telling me, Siwa. You're so she even went after poor E11. How late is that, E11? It was almost a year ago, wasn't it? That you that you wore the um, and it wasn't an like as if she would put an egg on her head, like as if she would take that kind of a risk. I'm sure uh, E11 is a little bit more creative than that dummy. Uh, she even went after poor E11. She's just grasping and hoping somebody else will talk shit on her. She's losing all hope that I'm done with her boring, pathetic, lying, uh, poor mothering ass. Oh, and by the way, her son made two community tab posts last night. I guess he was listening to his mom lie, so I had to straighten that shit out real quick. And we'll talk about it next live. <laughs> She's not connected. Hold on. <laughs> now people are going to... Because both. We're trying sweaty. to help you here, sweaty. We're trying to help sweaty. Get it together, lady. Oh, now she just dropped down. She's probably finding another Wi-Fi place. So hold on. Does anybody knows that that's when the devices they say device is not connected. It's because you got a bad connection. Yeah. And that would be happening if I had my computer. Well, I don't use the Wi-Fi for this, so I guess it doesn't matter. I use a direct line for this. Wow, they're so quick to run to Max Defense. What? They're running to Lewis's defense. Lewis said it himself. Nobody ever mentioned my brother. I never, ever, ever mentioned my brother. Yeah. Of course Lewis they are. Lewis, Lewis, you are far too vested in my life. Are too vested in everyone's life, like Lord. all of them are. All of them are, and apparently, so I guess I'm hearing. So, John, so now, um, Brooke is going to commentate on one of my old lives when I was pissed at you. Yeah, I saw that stupid E11 was posting, like how Jill's really feels about John. Mm. Like, but I can sit here from now until forever playing old clips of them saying shitty things about their old their friends. Exactly. Yeah. It it's so it's stupid. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. It is absolutely ridiculous. It is absolutely fucking ridiculous. What's ridiculous is the most thing that's got you pissed off, Jules, is you thinking I'm going to go live during your birthday stream. I I wouldn't even know if you idiots were live during my birthday stream because I didn't pay attention. I'm sure y'all were to sit over there and be so upset. That's what this is all stemming from. Grow up. And Lindsay, I plan to play the rest, but I don't remember what. There's some. I think there's some boring parts in here, but maybe not. What? John also said some really nasty things about me, and we're putting that behind us. Done. Yeah. But you know what? John never posted any of my deceased relatives, nor did I ever post any of his deceased relatives. John's never called the police to my But Geneva passed your mom's obituary around, the, uh, uh, and I quote, fuck with you, but what? and you're not mad at that? Make that make sense. Home, And I've never called the police to his home. Have I called the police regarding him that time when Fish was in? Okay, Sweaty's coming back. Hold on. Her device is not connected, but hold on. Okay. Come on, Sweaty, get it together. It says device not connected, so I can't add her yet. Come on, sweaty. Still not connected, sweaty. Here we go. Okay, she's in. Hey, sweaty. Sweaty, talk. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there she is. Okay, sweaty just. Oh my god! Sweaty. Please say you can hear me. Yes, we can I hear can you. Hear Brooks, you. No. Brooks, no. Brooks, no. Wait, wait, don't turn your camera on. Your camera's on. Okay. Camera's on. Want... Did you want your camera on? Oh, you did. Okay, okay, you did want it on. Okay, I don't want to be on camera. I'm not sweaty. Hi, girl. Okay, so you guys talk at the same time. Talk in unison at the same time. I'm not sweaty. I'm not sweaty. I'm not sweaty. I'm not sweaty. Sweaty. Okay. I really think I recognize that voice, unfortunately. And I'll have to tell some tell y'all who I think it is later, but because I could be wrong. But that's who I think it is. It's really unfortunate. 
la 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 we yeah, got it we go. we and i would say it out loud but i don't want to but this person's not even in our community anymore that i know of um but it sure sounds like somebody that used to be you heard you sweaty's voice. thank you burn the mic you heard sweaty's voice so you can i just say one other thing wait, and kiss one, my grits <laughs> yeah girl yeah <laughs> oh my gosh so now yeah, E11, she literally thought you had an egg balancing on your head or a, a, a somehow attached to your head. She literally had an egg on her head, an egg. Oh, my God. She's so insufferable. See what, if you're going to stay gone, stay gone. Don't just kind of come on here and poach so your members don't leave you because everybody knows it's what you're doing. Everybody knows. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, what y'all going to say? What are y'all gonna say now? I love that though. That was funny. She wanted us to kiss her grits. Hold on, let me go back to my favorite layout. See, I like this so much better. But I only put five people. Um, so yes, guys, we're here first. Breaking news. All right, we're stopping there at two hours and fifty-eight minutes. Actually, it's so cool because usually, even if my rumble's closed out, when I open my rumble back up, it starts right where I left off um, on this stream. So, but yeah. So uh, I'm gonna have to listen to the rest of that torture so we can get to the because, like, as if it sounds like it might be getting light. She's starting to talk off sugar and did it any bit. But it doesn't because, like I said, the real dirty, horrible shit comes soon. And maybe we can play part of it for her birthday stream. After all, we are celebrate everything jewels. And I've also got to go back through my treasure trove of stuff that I've got to see what all the old stuff I've got on her is. Plus the receipts and the real life proof or the proof that you go real life. And maybe a parody or two. Who knows? But we'll have to keep you updated as to when it's going to be. Oh, yeah. She was trying to go on TL now. I saw that. She's, she was poking anybody that hadn't talked about her in forever. She's like, Scamzilla. Like, she even doesn't even care if it's the wrath of, of AMZ. She don't care who it is as long as she has somebody to yell at. Because she still thought shit on me from what I understand. She can't help herself. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna play. I'm gonna about to get off. I'll play it next time. Or wait, maybe I can. Maybe I can play it before I get off. Hold on. No pun intended. No pun intended. That was a wrong word placement there. Plus, my uh, laptop's about to die. But uh, I don't know if I can even open Mox. Can you? Uh, I'm not even going to worry about it. Thank you, though. But I'm not going to worry about it because I don't think I can open it. With, and it's, I can, I can do, I can maneuver my trackpad, but and I'm not even having to look at it. Um, but I can't do all that other fancy shit. Opening up my text, sharing that, switching the share. I had all this pulled up already, and when I didn't, I was stopped. So. But thank you. I know you said, I want to play it next time. Maybe I'll make a whole, in no, that's gross. I was going to say, maybe I'll make an intro. Uh, we'll definitely play the shit out of it on her birthday party. Because again, we're celebrating her and everything about her. The good, the bad, and the ugly. I just not, I, if I had tentacles, maybe I could. I just can't. Because I, like I said, I've been strategically moving the, the, pad, the mouse pad with my finger and not even looking at my computer and only able to look at your comments on my phone, which is in front of me. Yeah, she's kissing Sweaty's ass. She kisses anybody's ass that she thinks going to give her money. That's how she is. That's how Siwa is. That's how John is. The funny part about it is that I'm like, I mean, I, it doesn't make a rip to hell who gives me donos or not. But y'all over there, it's so fucking obvious. Hey, broke nose! See what? <laughs> it's so pathetic. But anyway, I'm going to get out of here. My laptop's about to die. Anyways, but thank y'all so much for being here. Can someone tell me how Sewer went on missions years before she met Keaton when she met him at 15 or 16? 
because she was like, yeah, she was a mini, a mini missionary. None of her stories make sense, Missy. You know we're going to get on it. We'll do that, um, her stream next. Or, or, wait, we can't do that if we're celebrating jewels. I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, like I said, I'm going to have, the boys are going on a boy trip. And um, so I'll have an open weekend. All open. Anyway, I will see you guys later. I'm not sure who else is going live. Uh, but thank you all for being here. Please hit the like button if you don't mind. And I will see all of you guys very soon. Be watching the community tab or upcoming lives for the birthday extravaganza. All right. Y'all have a good evening. Uh-oh. Now I've got to strategize and look. Y'all have a good evening. I will see all of you very soon. Bye, everybody, and thanks again.